Hello everybody, my name is Turtle Cube, and welcome to Minecraft. Now, I'm in this room here because I promised a tour, and so, you now get a wonderful house tour. Yep, I finished my house, woohoo! And it looks really nice, this little inside part here. I worked a lot on this. It's a nice little lake. Here, so this is the front door, I'll show you outside later. Sneak peek. Um, this is my chest room, all my supplies and whatnot are just in here. Not sorted the neatest way possible, but to an extent, it's all sorted. Um, then I don't have any plans for this room yet, not entirely sure what I'm gonna do with that. Most of these rooms are still empty. I have to fix that. And this is the, um, little middle area. I've got a little lake. Um, bedroom's still here, enchantment room's still here, never got around to get more bookshelves. However, as you saw, I do have diamond armor now. I went mining, got a whole bunch of diamonds, um, when I went to go get the cobblestone to finish off the roof. The roof is all finished now. Um, yeah, so this is the inside part. Um, there were a couple complications. Uh, my house did get struck by lightning halfway through making it, so all of my sheep died, which is not good. I'm gonna have to get more sheep. A whole bunch of my pigs died as well. Um, horses are fine. And coolest thing, around the back over here, I have another little lake. I still need a couple lily pads for it, but I thought it was cool. So I decided against putting a room back here. I just put a little canopy thing. I cleared out a whole bunch of trees, but that was for something I'm going to show you later. Um, so yeah, here is my mostly finished house, besides the rooms on the inside. It has nice little bushes around the back. I've made a path to my nether portal. Um, so you just follow this path around here, and you get to the front. Now the front is very fancy with bushes, and this huge path here with lots of bushes on either side. If you come all the way down to the dock over here, and just look up the path. And I personally think that looks really, really cool. Um, so yeah, that is my finished house. You got, from the path, you got the mines over here. Large, a farm right there, large pathway just going up right to the front door. I'm, I'm really proud of this. I, don't, I haven't really done a front yard to this extent. Usually I've just done like a house and had it like right on the shore or something. So I just make a dock. I've never really done much with a path, or, so I'm, I'm really proud of how this turned out. I kind of like it. Now, as I said previously, I'm going to show you spawn. So, first off, here's my little dock. Uh, one of the other people on the server made this for me. It's very nice. Uh, and so we just go down this river. Um, we will get to spawn. I'm not entirely sure whose wall that is. Um, yeah, I haven't, <laughs> I haven't asked anyone really. But, uh, yeah, I don't know whose that is at all. I'm not entirely sure why this is here either. This hole. But it is. And we'll get to that in a bit. I keep running into things. Stay focused. Boats. Seems to be a popular place. Alright, so here we are at spawn. Little tiny wheat field. It's getting to be any time, but oh well. Not entirely sure where that goes. I might explore it at some point. But here is the spawn village. This is Eladin's shack and farmer stand. It's not really a shack anymore. It used to be a shack. Now it's a rather nice house. Um, here's the little watchtower. Here's the community bulletin board. If we go down over this way, we, did, we get to the bunny's house. Huge farms, chicken farm, cow farm, wheat farm. There's also 
claimed that waterfall as her own. Which I'm totally fine with, but it looks really nice. Yep, this is the bunny's place. And we go. Good eggs. We go explore the village a bit more. You can see some of the things. So let's see, this up here is the uh, bunny's leather and dye shop. Um, so you can get all these types of dyes and leather and apparently ink sacks. I guess that's a dye. Um, this is my shop. I make custom banners and building materials. From building my house, I have a lot of stuff. Now, I did actually kind of completely forget that all this cobblestone was here, and I kept going to mine more cobblestone when I needed it, but whatever. Learn from your mistakes. <laughs> um, we have the spawn nether portal. So you just, um, one of the people on the server kind of likes hooking up all the nether portals in the nether, so there's like fancy little pathways and whatnot. I don't think any of them are finished yet though, so I might show them once they're finished. Um, community farm, there's never really much in here. I'm not entirely sure why someone might keep killing them, I don't know. Uh, you come up here. Um, up here, this is what I cleared out all of the birch wood for. This is the roof of that place. This is a um, tree farm. I don't know why you need a tree farm in a forest, but it's actually not a bad idea. If you just keep chopping down the trees in here, then you can leave the forest the way it is. Um, and then down here, so not just jump over the... Is there a staircase there? There is a staircase over here. I missed that. Over here is the gate. So you just hit a button, the door's open, you can go out, there's a creeper, run away. I'll show you from the outside later. Um, but yeah, this is the wall kind of overlooking east. This is east, west, north, south. And yeah, that's pretty much all that's near spawn. Oh, I didn't know this was open. Sweet. Yeah, it's pretty much all that's near spawn. Everybody else has moved quite a bit of ways in different directions. Um, at least a couple of people have moved that way. One as far as like almost 9,000 blocks in that direction. I'm not entirely sure why, but exploring. Gives you a lot of resources as you go that way. I did actually go off to visit her house at one point, and it is, it's like on a little island in the middle of a forest. It's pretty cool. I haven't seen anything like it before. Um, but that's quite a while away. One of the projects, and you can get an almost front view of this. One of the projects next to do, I'm going to have to kill you, aren't I? Is to make a path all the way to her little island. Oh dear. Um. All right then. <laughs> um. So yeah, that's just about it. There's another little pathway over here. The pathways aren't finished. Um. They will be finished in the future, but this is all kind of a work in progress. Things going on over here. Um, so yeah, that's about it. That's about all of spawn. Little ripper over there. Hmm. So yeah, there's not really much else to show. Um, I think I'm gonna wait until the morning so I can show you the outside of that gate because it looks pretty cool. It still is, needs to be finished, but it looks pretty cool. Why? Why is there a zombie here? How did a zombie get here? Where are you guys coming from? Seriously. It is a beautiful sunrise. Let's see, are there any mobs out here? Not that I see. Cool. Except I hear you. 
here the spider. Uh -huh. You dead now. There's a creeper. Let's see if I can shoot it. Nope. There we go. Dead. Dead little creeper. Alright, so. Here it is from the outside. I think that looks pretty cool. I'm gonna say if it needs any help making this. I'm not entirely sure why that button's there. It doesn't do anything. But it's there. So I'm gonna see if he needs any help fixing this. Uh, the person who made most of this, uh, I have to get credit to uh, Eladin Erickson. Um, he did, like, pretty close to 60%, maybe more, of everything that's here, which is pretty awesome. I've helped here and there, like, I made my, um, store, I've made the, uh, roof to that place. Um, I helped a bit with the mechanism inside that door. Um, but most of that, I did a little bit of this staircase over here, too, but most of this is Eladin. And maybe one or two other people I don't know about, but it's mostly all of them. So, actually, cool. there's also a uh, XP farm down that way. So, that looks like that's going to be on the list to make a path to. So, yeah, it looks like there's a whole bunch of stuff that's going to be coming up. Uh, I'm probably going to try and make videos on a lot of it, probably not most of it, because some of it might be boring, but I'm going to try and make videos on a lot of it, just so you guys can see what's going on here, and I catch up with everything that's going on. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's pretty much the entire, whoa, my boat's freaking out. <laughs> that's pretty much the entire spawn area. As I said before, people have uh, moved off pretty far away in other directions and you know paths haven't been made yet and whatnot but so yeah I think that's about it for this video it is much shorter than the last two but um, not entirely why there's a pig on a tree there is a pig on a tree hi hi pig Alright, we'll see you there next time. As I was saying, this is this video is much shorter than the last two, but it's mainly because I don't have much to do. All that I'm currently doing right now is mining and seeing if anybody needs help with stuff. Um, I do have a couple projects on my own that I might... Um, I'm not sure when I'll end up doing. I will do them, I'm just not sure when. Um, so, yeah. This has been the uh, server tour. Server and house tour. And, until next time.